Smoke a purse so sweet with Hot Thoughts TV. Y'all know what the fuck we doing, man. It's Hot Thoughts TV. Niggas hot in the beach, man. I'm smoking a purse so sweet with Hot Thoughts TV. But yeah, Megan, Megan, I'm... Shit. All he said, he popped it a day before he, she yeah, shot him. Yeah, she yeah. Yeah. Damn, that's probably why they shot her. <laughs> that's probably why they shot her, bro. You was with that nigga? Bow! Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. What you think? Uh, there's another topic that's that's going on right now. The PNB Rock situation. You know, it first started. They were blaming his girlfriend, saying she dropped the location. And then it ended up being like, damn, near this whole household of people. See, I'm from Houston, and like, we like that too, as far as the time. But LA, like, you can't bring them straps out there. So everybody that come off the planes. They ain't got them straps. And niggas from out there, they know. I mean, them celebrities, they got that jewelry on, but they ain't got them straps. I hear it's different. Like, they know, yeah, they, them niggas out here, they either fucking with somebody or, or they, they got them motherfuckers on them. So it's like, shit, if you go down there, you got to take the risk of either taking one of them pistol charges, and they pistol charges different than I. Like, you got to, you just got to, if you go down there, you got to move right. Now you gonna lose for sure. I know a bunch of niggas that lost street niggas, real gangsters, and, and shit. Them niggas that lost like a motherfucker. Yeah. Lost, lost, lost. Homie lost his life, but they didn't lost you know real money fucking with LA. But that's how the LA moved though. We moved like that too, but as far as our town, but shit, you just gotta learn. You gotta know how to move. You gotta know how to move in yeah, LA. You get, all that checking in and all that other shit, shit, that's probably the best thing to do in LA. Yeah. <laughs> like since Nip died, niggas, niggas, a lot of the rapper niggas, a lot of the rapper niggas, uh, shit, they don't got they don't, they don't got nobody to go down there and fuck with, cause they don't know, they don't know nobody, no rip. So you gotta be really tied in. And I ain't saying homie not tied in or not, but he should have been. He should have had a nigga, a young nigga. Or he should have. I don't know. I don't know what he should have done, but. I wouldn't have been eating that waffles and chicken uh, with my jewelry on, with my guy with no strap on. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't have been doing it. I don't eat that goddamn waffle highs in Houston. <laughs> By myself with, with with 10 motherfuckers with no jewelry on. So shit, I, I can't imagine. I, I wouldn't have been out there like that. And he, been, he was saying it. He was saying it. He was saying it. The nigga was saying it. He was saying niggas been playing with him. In LA, man, he ain't figured that shit out. Ain't nobody told him. Like he, where he, where he from? Who is that? The PNB Rock. Oh, he from Philly. Man, Philly, Philly niggas some gangsters though. They should have, like, they getting that shit from LA too. They should have been somebody, one of his home boys, should have been tied in with somebody down there. Man, let them know, hey man, that's ain't you don't do that. Yeah, what's your thoughts on this on security? Some niggas be feeling like you know like. They too cool, I feel like. Yeah, that's prime example. Prime example. See, like, I ain't no gangster. I ain't no, I ain't no, I ain't no street nigga. But I guarantee you, if I go to the streets, I'm gonna be, you know, with some street niggas that actually fuck with me some type of way. Or, we ain't going. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We gonna be in a, in a, in a, in a, corporate environment or something like that, but ain't no reason for a nigga that ain't in the streets to go to the streets without the, you know, the protection of the streets. You crazy in the motherfucker. You go to uh, anywhere else, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You gonna, you know, it's shit, the president, look, the president, the biggest thing in the world, you're not gonna be able to walk up on him. And and some people hate him, some people love him. So a rapper, man, hell no. Nah. But they, they just show a lot of these rap niggas they ain't, they think, they ain't really from the streets, they ain't really tied into the streets. Even the street niggas, when they go to another nigga territory, another nigga area, they got security, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They tapping in, either they got police security or, you know, some, you know, some street security. But shit, I'd rather, you know, put a couple hundred dollars in the right people pocket 
than uh <clears throat> lose my life or my necklace or you know what I'm saying or, or some shit you know this shit all that checking in shit man that's a privilege if you would go to the nigga I call hey nigga I'm being L A nigga I'm come out there and fuck with you with all right that nigga make sure I come home safe shit that nigga that work that shit that works the relationship and more you know. But some niggas, them niggas ain't, they ain't, they ain't never tied into the streets. If you ever was in them motherfuckers, you'll understand. A lot of the internet niggas they ain't gonna, oh, check it in. I would never do that. I'm a gangster. Nigga, you tripping there. You gonna die just like that little nigga.